Peter, such a tragic scene out here. We've been seeing family members coming and going all day, visibly upset, as you can imagine. Take a look behind me. You can see firefighters are still out here investigating. The fire started around 11 a.m. Five people were inside the home when the fire broke out. Firefighters tell me that the cause of the fire is still under investigation, but a family member tells me off camera there's concern that the eight-year-old boy was playing with matches. We're told that the grandmother ran back into the house to try and rescue the little boy. Both died on the scene. Three others were able to escape. Now, firefighters say that it's always difficult on them when lives are lost. Take a listen. It's uh, extremely uh, tragic. I mean, we... Uh... We take a lot of pride in, in what we do, and uh, the firefighters here today are, uh, uh, acted uh, uh, very uh, heroically like uh, they normally do every day. Now, as you can see right there, the home is red tagged, so it is unlivable at this time. We're told that the family who lived inside that house will be taken care of by other family members tonight. Peter, back to you in the studio.